So I waited a little bit to make this video because I kind of wanted to let everybody who was gonna get banned get banned, but now that it's been like a week since uh, this has been added, well, I think it's okay to make the video now. Um, it's pretty much public knowledge anyways, but uh, you might have seen my video from about maybe a few weeks ago, I don't know, maybe a month ago, I honestly don't remember, but it was uh, about vape... Vape cracked vape and how they could patch it, how Hypixel could patch it. And uh, believe it or not, they actually did. And I was blown away. I did not expect that to, expect that to happen at all. I was um kind of just expecting nothing to happen. But they added it. And what they did is uh, they silently put in the like little chat message that triggered it. And, but didn't ban anybody for about, I think, maybe five days or something. Uh, one of my friends noticed it when he was messing with the chat, like uh, making a mod to do with the chat. And he noticed that it was, you know, the message was coming up that triggered Crack the Vape. And uh, it wasn't banning, though. And then they just did a ban wave on a few days ago, maybe a week ago now, Um of everybody who used it in that past five days or whatever. And it was around 400 people who got banned in that ban wave. Which is... Doesn't sound like a lot, I guess, since there's so many people on the server. But that's actually a fair amount, especially since they were all closet cheaters who probably wouldn't have been detectable any other way. At least not, like, through a moderator spectating them. So, yeah, 400 people banned is pretty respectable. Um, and it's going to continue banning anybody who logs in with vape. Um, basically what it does is it'll send that chat message right when you log in. Then when you go to join a game, it'll ban you pretty much instantly. And an interesting thing they did is they put uh, vape in the ban message. It says like watchdog cheat detection. Then you know how it usually says GG, which I don't know what that means. But um, it's it's one of their codes. They literally replace GG with vape. And uh, when you go to appeal, I'll probably put a picture on the screen. Uh, when you go to appeal, it says your account was banned for having or being associated with the vape hacked client. Which is interesting. I'm not sure why they made it so public that that's why you're getting banned. Because if I were them, I would just play it off like it's a normal watchdog ban. Because you don't want people to know. I mean, I'm making this video, but generally you don't want hackers to know that that the cracked vape is the cause of their ban. I know, since I'm making this video, anybody who was going to use cracked vape and hasn't already uh, now knows not to. But I think it's been enough time. Um, I think basically what they did is you either got a 30 a day ban and no stat swipe or, uh, or a stat swipe and a permanent ban, which was pretty serious, pretty insane. It's like automatic stats wipe, which they have not done before, actually. Which is a very serious punishment, and uh, it's great, honestly. It's awesome. So, I guess some people uh, got 30-day bans because maybe they logged in with a different IP or something. Like, someone went to hack on their account and for some reason used cracked vape, I don't know. But... That's pretty much it. Um, yeah, I, I'm just blown away that they actually patched it. I'm my video, um, I it blew up pretty big, like for my channel size, and I guess a lot of people saw it, <laughs> obviously. But I uh, I didn't expect it to actually happen, so I have to give major props to Crypt Keeper and the the admin team in general. Because I really think it it uh, cleaned up the community a little bit. I'll put a few names on in the description, maybe or on screen, of people that got banned who were notable. Um, I'm not really big on the public shame, but you know, they were banned kind of indirectly because of me. So I guess that's something to be proud of. At least it's better than getting people false bans like my last video. This is a real ban, real legitimate ban. Banning cheaters, that's what we really want. Anyways, um, yeah, once again, thank you to the admin team, if they're watching this. I mean, I doubt they are, but 
you know, you got to give them props, credit where credit is due. Um, they listen to their community. I think recently they're doing a great job of listening to the community. I have to point that out because I give the admin team so much shit. I mean, I basically dissed Watchdog for like two minutes in my vape video. Um, I was like, oh, Watchdog can't detect vape or anything. I mean, Watchdog can't detect B-Hop. That's pretty much what I said. And uh, assuming they watched that video, they heard me being rude to their prized Watchdogs. So, I don't know. Maybe they don't like me. Whatever. But you gotta give them credit where credit is due. They did a great job on this, and they're doing a great job of listening to their community recently. Like, if you guys don't know, um, there was gonna be a UHC update, and they put out proposed uh, UHC changes. And then ev everybody in the community said, oh, these are trash. This is not... Do you even play, like, UHC? And then they listened to community feedback, and a few days later put out a new... Uh, new, like, proposed changes, and everybody was happy with it. And, uh, that's, that's really good that they're interacting with the community on such, on that level, you know, so closely, that it actually impacts, like, what the game is, which, I mean, that's the point, like, it's for the community, you better listen to them, and uh, so many games don't do that, like, not just Minecraft, just so many games in general. Don't listen to their community. Don't interact with their community. And, you know, Hypixel is huge. It is like a top 10 game on Steam or something if it was its own game. So the fact that they're interacting so closely with their community is fantastic. And I really hope that continues to happen. And I'm not pretending like I'm some god who got people banned and I'm the savior of the world because I made that video. I was just the messenger. People already knew about uh, the cracked vape patch and all that, and I'm not really taking credit because, you know, someone else could have made the video. I think it was pretty much public knowledge. Well, I don't know if it was public because I didn't know about it, and I'm pretty, you know, in the community, in the coding community, but, you know, I, uh, I'm not taking too much credit. You gotta give credit to the admins for implementing it. And that's what I've just spent the last three minutes rambling on about doing. So, hopefully, uh, that cleans up the cheaters a little bit. I'll be honest, it was less people than I expected. Like, 400 people, and counting, because it's going to continue to ban. Uh, 400 people is not bad at all. And it might be even more. Like, I'd, I'd go even 500 people. But 400 people got banned in that one ban wave. And I can post proof of that because Watchdog uh, messages and stuff. Or Watchdog has public API records that you can just check how many people were banned in the last minute. And uh, they just did that ban wave of everybody who used it. Okay, so point is, thank you admins. You guys are doing great. And I hope you keep up the good work. And I hope you keep on improving Watchdog. Because it does have ways to go. But... If you're doing this, and you, if you're listening to your community, uh, you know, you're on the right track. And, yeah, if you guys want more of that sort of video, leave a comment down below. Like, uh, not, not just commentary or gameplay or anything, just talking about things. I get talking about things, you know. Kind of like Tenebrous style video. If you guys want videos Tenebrous style, where he just talks about gameplay and you know, how Minecraft works and that sort of thing. I would love to do some sort of things like going into the code of mods and explaining how stuff works. Um, you know, that might be fun. And if people are interested, let me know. Anyways, thanks for watching. If you got banned, ha, get fucked.